Hey guys, um, so I've just finished uh, filming my summer, my green whatever summer look and I just thought of doing something different. Um, um, I thought of doing a haul, why not? Um, because I have lots of requests um, of friends and staff um, asking me what foundation I use uh, and what products I really like. So I thought of doing it. So to start with, I'm gonna do um, my foundation. Is the ones that I really like. I'm gonna start with the ones, um, you know, not the worst, but the ones that aren't so good till the best one. So to start with, um, well, I don't know. It's really hard, but I would start with Bourjois and um, Healthy Mix. That looks like this. And it is a really good foundation, um, but I don't know. I just felt like it didn't last really long. I think I bought this um, one month ago, and it's already finished. It's not that I used that much, but it really, really uh, finished quick, really quick. It's really good. It makes your look, um, your skin look um, natural and not cakey at all but it runs out really quickly so this one it's number five number four i would say revlon color stay it looks like this oh yeah and the color i use on bourgeois is 54 just in case you're wondering uh yeah number four revlon color stay um this foundation is actually really really good um, but I think that the texture of it is quite heavy I don't know it does not feel heavy when you put I mean a little bit but it doesn't feel heavy when you put it on your skin but I don't know I just feel like it's quite the, the, I don't know the texture is not that good and also, um, one time I used it and then I tried mixing with some other foundation and I don't know what happened, my skin went all, I don't know, strange, some different colours and not good for mixing with other foundations. So that's my number four. My number three, um, I would say my uh, Dior Skin, is that how you call it? Dior Skin Forever looks like this I've lost the tab so yeah uh, this is a really really good foundation I was in love with it for the first three years I've used it for three years without changing and it was the best foundation ever but I think that the coverage is not that perfect I mean you can you know work on it and you know but if you put just one uh, amount of it, you won't get a full skin like it says here. So um, it is a really good foundation. I don't have anything to say, but I think the coverage is not that good. Um, and the price of it, I think it's 27 now. But yeah, I forgot to say the prices. This one, I think, is around £12. Um, this one, around 12 as well. 10 12 Yeah, the red one. Um, Jewel um, is around 26 uh, and my second best foundation is the NARS Sheer Glow which looks like this has been used a lot <laughs> uh, well this one has been my favourite as well for the last um, two months I've used it um, and yeah it was really good and it is really good that's why it's on the second place but However, I don't know what to say. It's a really good foundation, but I felt like my skin went really oily after some hours. Like on my, I don't even know the name of this thing. But yeah. I'm not English, no English, guys. So yeah, uh, it used to be quite um, oily in some parts of my face. So I didn't like that. Not really. So yeah, that's second place and this one is 29 pounds if I'm not wrong but it's a really good foundation guys don't get me wrong uh, my number one foundation 
is basically loaded double air. Oh my god, this is like heaven. It's the best foundation I've yet like ever ever used. And this ones are not the only ones I've used. I've used I've used like every single foundation <coughs> that is out there. <coughs> and this one is so so good. I mean it's a really good foundation. The coverage is perfect. I use it like just a little amount. That's the one I've just used um, now. I use it just a little bit and it will like do the job. It will definitely make your skin look flawless. It, it is quite um, durable. It lasts you the whole day. I can tell you that. I don't even, when I put it on, I don't need to retouch it. I don't need to do anything. It will just stay like this whole day. And I went, I went gym with this and it actually didn't come off so I think, I don't know if it's waterproof or something but it is amazing I mean, best foundation ever 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 and it's not that expensive, I think it was 25 pounds so, a bargain because it, I mean the quality is so so good and the colour I use on this one is uh, um, beige yeah, beige. Yeah, twenty five pounds. So really good price for a good product. So yeah, that was my top five um, foundations. So number five, Bourjois. Number four, Revlon Color Stay. Number three, Forever Dual Skin Forever. Uh, number two, Nars Shea Glow. And number one, Estee Lauder Double Wear. So yeah, that was my top five foundations. Um, I think I'm not gonna do anything else because I mean I don't really have that much time because I'm not a partner of YouTube. So yeah, if you want um, me to do reviews or a haul or anything else, just let me know and I'll do it. So yeah, guys, see you and have a great time. I mean, great time? No, I mean just. Yeah, bye.